Hey everybody, Brett from Stardust Gaming here, back with some more Warhammer 40k Death Watch. So we're finally into Act 6, where we're going to be doing the first part, obviously. Um, so let's look at the new scenario. Uh, we are now at Stranglehold, um, where we were at Gargantua before. So, let's see, a rogue hive ship penetrated the Imperial lines and is now orbiting the gas giant Stranglehold. Inquisitor Harkin, with three squads of space marines, was sent to destroy the hive ship using the new bioagent. The strike force was lost before completing their mission. The Death Watch must finish what Harkin started. Okay. Hopefully we didn't lose all of the bio-agent that we spent so long trying to defend. Uh, the creation of, anyway. That would be a little bit disheartening if that was the case. But, uh, so yeah, so part one, days. The Death Watch have located the hive ship in Strangleholds Gravity, Gravity Well and fought their way to the ship's stabilizing canal. The kill team must now destroy the vibroid glands to destabilize the ship. Okay. So blow the thing up so the ship gets blown up. Right. Anywho, uh, let's go ahead and get started. So probably gonna switch back to Ventress here. I don't think doing two Devastators is gonna be a very good idea. So where is he? There he is. Okay, so that looks a little bit better. Uh, yeah, I think we'll just take this team right here. This is our uh, our A squad, I guess. So yeah, we'll go ahead and deploy. Kill team. Your mission is to gut this foul vessel and leave it as a carapace in the void. Destroying the vibroid glands in this area will destabilize the ship. Ready your weapons. The hive mind senses your presence and wakens its forces. Right, so I don't know what vibroid glands are, and I'm not sure I want to find out, but let's go ahead and uh, start doing this here. Looks like we are heading the other direction. So let's get him out this way. Hmm, looks like he can actually shoot them from there. Okay. Um, Ventress, why don't you... No, no, no. That's two, that's three. Let's do that. Oh, we got a Tyranid there. Doesn't look like he can shoot those. Oh, yeah, he can. Deal with... Oh, man. I thought we had him. Blast those for me. Are they down? I don't think they're down. Um, we'll have him... <clears throat> Excuse me. We're going to have him uh, carry over all of his AP there. And then let's have you step up here. Oh, you have another shot. Whoops. Oh, you missed them both. Probably should have just had him overwatch then. And let's see. One, two. Going to overwatch like so. And then we're going to have him shoot these glands. I don't know how much damage we need to do. Let's throw a grenade at him too, because why not? Wow. Those are some pretty resilient glands. Uh, yeah, sure, throw a grenade at that guy. There we go. Finally we put him down. Oh, we got another AP for the kill, cool. Let's go ahead and move up then. And yeah, I think that'll do it. Okay, so they're going to run up on me. This guy's going to absolutely wreck him. Hmm. Yikes. Hmm. Wow, you're just terrible at aiming, aren't you? Ah, uh, jeez. Okay, at least... Oh, uh, never mind. I was going to say, at least he can put him down. 
Well, there's one. Should be able to get the other right here. There's two. Um, I could overwatch, but I think I'd rather move up and secure this spot. It's a much better spot to overwatch from. So what kind of... So he's a tyrant guard. Why don't you throw a frag at him? And you sort of missed. So let's see, I'm going to step back one. I'm going to break line of sight here and overwatch. Now then, Ventress, you're going to move out of the way. And you're just going to unleash hell on this thing. Okay, he got it. Ooh, let's take a long shot here. Not very effective. We got one more point. Let's go ahead and move. Hopefully we can break line inside again. I don't think he has a ranged attack. I think he's melee only. But we probably don't want to let him get that close. Okay, we got a little bit of overwatch on him, but not much. Got a, got Gene Sealers coming out of the woodwork too. Luckily, the uh, the Melty Guns put them down pretty quick. Okay, so you can sort of help out there. Ventress is kind of worthless on this map. I'm gonna have you step back. Got a free one there. I keep dealing out damage here as best I can. Uh, I'm not going to do that one just yet. Let's go for a big shot here with the plasma gun. Uh, that was pretty pathetic, to be honest. Go ahead and do that. Do some more damage. And why don't you do yours too? I don't know if his includes uh, friendlies or not. It doesn't look like it does. Hmm. Why don't you blast that guy? No? There it is. Have him move up and cover this corner. And then you, you could step up to here. Go ahead and take a shot. Several misses there, and then we'll save the last one. So he's going to get some attacks off. Several, actually. Okay, a miss, a miss. Oh, three misses. Wow, we got lucky there. I don't think we'll get that lucky again, though. So the plasma is not really working. Um, nothing's really working, to be honest. Um, I wonder if the melta gun would have better luck. Okay, so Ventress is worthless. That tickled him, at least. Oh god, we're in so much trouble here. I'm going to swing back around. That puts him in range. 19 damage. Not going to cut it. 70, that's a little bit better. And you need to put somebody down. Oh, wow. Okay. So, don't want to use that. Um, Venture's probably just going to heal himself after he gets whacked here. These guys are going to take some serious damage, though. Uh, that's not so bad there. Oh, got him on the counterattack. He's going to step in. He's going to absolutely wreck Dagmar. And we'll get him on the counterattack again. Cool. 
Right, so we're just going to keep firing at this guy. There's a miss. Can we get him with the grenade? We can. Oh, hurt ourselves a little bit there. Come on, you got this. One more. Yes. Okay. So that could have gone a lot worse for us, I feel like. Of course, Ventress can't hit anything to save his life right now. There it is. Just took all of my AP to do it. Okay, Dagmar's pretty beat up. We'll let uh, we'll let Elijah take point here. Let's see. Can you Overwatch? Yeah, you can. Okay, we're gonna start being a little bit smarter here. No, don't do that. Okay. Kind of gather ourselves here and then we'll get back on the move. Got him. Okay. I think that's the last two. So it's just a matter of clearing a path here. Oh, he got a freebie. No, wrong guy. Ah, man. Well, you may as well move here. Can't do anything else. That sucks. Oh, well. One, two. Let's have you turn the corner. He's kind of a threat right there, but at least Dagmar's behind cover. Uh, let's throw a grenade at this thing. Oh, that was Dagmar. Whoops. Whatever, it worked. Oh, wow, that wiped one out. You can go ahead and frag this thing. Did that do it? Doesn't look like it did it. That did it. Uh-oh. Oh, we just need to extract. Okay, I thought they were going to spawn a giant Tyranid. Place the bomb. Where are we doing that? I don't know. I'm gonna have you overwatch this way because that gene stealer is gonna run up on us. You can move up. You can move up. And we're gonna have you save those AP for later. And let's see what happens. Oh, we missed. Oh, Gene Sealer behind us. Okay, why don't you kill him? And then he's next on the list. That's not really going to do it. Uh, you need to kill these two. Awesome. Let's get Ventress up here. Uh, not quite good enough. Let's see, you got a freebie, so you can move there. And then I'm going to move you here. And maybe one more. Okay, so you can overwatch this way. Actually, can you shoot them from there? You can. That might be a better option. There's one, and I should be able to target him now. Cool. So that worked out. And you can overwatch this, so when the Gene Stealer runs up on us, we've got him. Dead to rights. So he's down. Another one behind us. And another in front of us. But I think that's going to be probably it for the major threats, anyway. So he's down. Ventress is going to continue to take point, I guess. OK, 
can't hit him. You've got a shot. Let's do that. And then let's see. One, two. Gonna overwatch here. Do the same there. Gonna have him move up. Actually, that probably wasn't the best move there. Actually, I'll go right there, and then I can have them follow. Okay. Yeah, he's done. One behind us, one immediately next to us. Probably for the best that these guys are a little bit out in front, just because they do have to go a little bit further. Um, let's see if we can get the melee kill here. Nope. Come on. There it is. Right, so I'm going to move him up all the way. I'll let uh, Sindril take point here. There's nobody over here, so I'm going to move them up a little bit further just so I can push. Oh, spoke too soon. Well, uh, I was hoping that would do it. He's in line of sight, so I can't use that ability. One, two. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to hit him no matter what. I'll go there, and then I'm going to have him save the last one for next turn. And over here, hopefully you can deal with him. Come on, Elijah. I'll let Dagmar finish it then. One, two, one, two. And he got a freebie, so we'll let him overwatch. Okay. Yikes. It looks bad because they do so many hits, but at least the hits aren't for very much damage. Still got Gene Steelers coming out behind us. Uh, how do I want to do this? Let's have you step back one. Because I don't want to get caught in the blast when he explodes. Kill him. Oh, come on. you got to make that shot. There it is. And kill him. Shoot. Not good. Okay, so he's down now. That will let him take one more step and overwatch no never mind okay then we're just gonna move toward the target you can do the same there and there back here let me just blow them up there we go we'll just double time it and wow he didn't get any freebies there that's interesting but yeah it should be one more turn and then we're out of here probably take as many free kills as I can let's have you blow him up there we go so let's see you can get to there hey right there Dagmar is going to go to that corner. Ventress will take this one. And that should do it. Unless we miss something. No? So let's end our turn. Cool. Bombs place, we win. Hopefully, plenty of XP to go around here. Um, looks like everybody did okay, with the exception of Sindril, who did really, really well. Damn near doubled these guys. And what do we get? Another ooh, an Impendence Field. We haven't seen one of those yet. I think that's better than the Refractor Field. Um, let's take a look at level ups, and then we'll go ahead and break off the episode. 
Okay, so I think we had some level ups planned for Syndral and Incarnus. I don't know if they've made it to the threshold that we were looking for yet. Uh, Ventress and Elijah have uh, level ups available too, so let's check these guys out. Uh, let's see, he's got 76. Um, we could take that, or we could take another level up. Let's go ahead and get this now, we'll get it out of the way. And then, oh, I got an achievement for that. Looks like we have enough for... No, we don't. It flashes a couple of times before it goes away. Um, so 4,000. Yeah, that'll be available long before this is. So we'll just keep leveling him up. Incarnus. Uh, let's see. Just his rocket specialization. I'd like to get this one. So we'll hang on to the XP for now. That one I'd also like to get, but that's more of a pipe dream, really. This is okay, but not anything I absolutely need. And I'd like to get him to a higher level, too. Let's see what this... Where'd it go? This thing. Let's see what this does. Passive plus 10% damage mitigation. What was the refractor field? 15 dodge for ranged. Hmm. Let's do this one. Okay. So Ventress, um, 3300, probably not going to be enough to get any of these. 8000, 6000, 4000. Not super useful though, because I think he's the only Ultramarine we roll with. Uh, that's okay, I guess. Or we could take another level up. I wasn't really impressed with this melted gun, to be honest. But I think that's probably... Huh. I think it's probably the best option. I think we tried this already, and I wasn't very impressed with it either. So we'll just stick with that for now. But yeah, I'm I'm underwhelmed with that gun. And I suppose we'll hang on to the XP in hopes of getting one of his other traits. Which just leaves Elijah. Let's see, 1600. We could take another level up. His accuracy is pretty good. His crit kind of sucks. What's this do? Plus 30 damage mitigation. I think I'll save up for that first. So we'll hang on to this until we get this one, because this is really good. And then uh, then we'll worry about leveling him up some more. So yeah, that's going to do it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Um, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Please feel free to share my videos however you guys see fit. And I will see you guys back here for the next part of our Warhammer 40k Death Watch Let's Play.